to welcome you guys to our youth and family church service uh, here this Sunday. Uh, we are really grateful to be participating in it. Before we start praying, I just want to say that we have an amazing God and that He loves you very much. And um, during these times, um, just have fun with your family. Um, stay focused, stay positive, and have fun. Um, now my son will share. Yeah, just um, to all the uh, preteens that um, that just stay close to God and um, just make sure you're in your Bible and getting close to God in this moment. And I know y'all on your games. Trust me, I am too. But like, you got to make sure that God comes first between all of that. I would like to just say to um, stay safe and keep y'all self-connected to others because even throughout this time, like... There's like so much going on, but you have phones. Like, you know y'all use them. Just like call anyone and check up on how their day was. Like s small things like that will make their day. And just make sure that you're staying close with God and that just to remember that He's your anchor. Mm -hmm. Let's pray. Dios Todopoderoso, te damos la gracia por este día, Padre. Esté con el servicio que ayude lo que van a predicar, que tengan. Eh, sabiduría y que la, las palabras que hablen sean directamente de Dios Padre, esté con lo, la gente allá afuera que, que están pasando por uh, tiempos uh, difíciles Padre, para la gente que ha perdido gente ayúdalos a eh, estar fuertes durante estos tiempos Padre, y siga protegiéndolos, en el nombre de tu Hijo Jesús te oramos, Amén Amén Thank you Jesus for this day, thank you for um, everything that you've done for us God, thank you for um, just giving us the technology and the time to just have service God, just um, just thank you for my family and everybody, uh, most people that I know that are healthy, God. Uh, thank you for um, just giving us this time during this uh, coronavirus and lockdown, God. Just um, just pray for all the people that are infected, God, and just um, that, that you would just heal them. And um, I pray for the people that are not affected, that you would just um, give them the wisdom to wear a mask or be aware of the elderly so that they won't get sick. Uh, and I just pray in your precious son's name. Amen. 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 Home and stay safe, children. And enjoy, enjoy the service. Building up the kingdom. Building up the kingdom of the Lord. Brother, won't you help me? Sister, won't you help me? Building up the kingdom of the Lord. It's so hard. I can't get over it. It's so low. Can't get on the rich. It's so wide. Can't do it. Gotta go through that. Got the kingdom. Building up the kingdom. Building up the kingdom of the Lord. Brother, can you help me? Sister, can you help me? Building up the kingdom of the Lord. It's so high, you can't go over it. It's so low, you can't go under it. It's so wide, you can't go around it. You gotta go through that. Building up the kingdom. Building up the kingdom. Building up the kingdom of the Lord. We are going to be singing Jesus Loves the Little Children. Jesus loves the little children and all the children in the world. Red and yellow, black and white, they are fresh, he's in his sight. Jesus loves the little children of the world. Jesus fights for all the children, all the children of the world. Red and yellow, black yellow, and white, black, they are precious white. in the sight. Jesus loves the little children of the world. Jesus lives for all the children, all the children of the world. Red and yellow, black and white, they are precious in the sight. Jesus lives for all the children of the world. Red, yellow, black and white. Hey y'all, welcome back for another Bible story time. We're going to sing a, a little song about the gospel chariot. So we've been reading through the gospels and learning about Jesus' great miracles. And now we started doing some of his parables. So we're going to do another parable today, but we're going to roll this gospel chariot along. And we brought our friends, uh, little troll, Tim Tebow, Scotty Pippins here, Don Mattingly, and little baby doll. Because our kids are getting too big to pick them up. But you can bring a toy or you can try and pick up your big kids too. You ready, Nana? Let's sing it. 
We're gonna roll the, the gospel chariot along. Come on and roll the gospel chariot along. You gotta roll the gospel chariot along. And we won't tag along behind. If your brother's in the way, you will stop and pick him up. If your brother's in the way, you will stop and pick him up. If your brother's in the way, you will stop and pick him up. And we won't tag along behind. So roll, roll the gospel chariot along. You gotta roll the gospel chariot along. Come on and roll the gospel chariot along. And we won't tag along behind. If your sister's in the way, you will stop and pick her up. If your sister's in the way, you will stop and pick her up. If your sister's in the way, you will stop and pick her up. And we won't tag along behind. So roll, roll the gospel chariot along. Come on and roll the gospel chariot along. You gotta roll the gospel chariot along. And we won't tag along behind. If the devil's in the way, we will stop all over him. If the devil's in the way, we will stop all over him. If the devil's in the way, we will stop all over him, and we won't tag along behind. So roll, roll the gospel chariot along. We gotta roll the gospel chariot. Come on and roll the gospel chariot along, and we won't tag along behind. All right, oh, so you gotta work out picking up your your big kids and little kids, but we're gonna read. In Matthew chapter 21 this time, and we're going to look at the parable of the two sons. Now, this is not the same as the prodigal son, which is also a great story. But we're, we're going to start in this story and again, just take you to a little different rendition of it and get a chance to ask some questions afterwards. So Matthew chapter 21, starting in verse 28, starts off with the question, what do you think? There was a man who had two sons. And he got to pick up compost. Because I got to go to work. Yeah, 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 whatever. I'm going to take it out. Whatever. No, I'm not doing it. I got to play my game. I'm not doing it. I was game for it. Let me do it. Oh. I got you, Dad. Dad works hard. Guy. He went know. to the first son and said, Son, go and work today in the vineyard. I will not, he answered, but later changed his mind and went. Then the father went to the other son and said the same thing. He answered, I will, sir, but he did not go. You guys enjoyed that story, but the last question says, Which of the two did what his father wanted, Jenna? The first one. Parents, this week, do you need to be more flexible or more structured? What is something new that you're going to try this week? Share ideas with us. I'm hoping that you guys are getting some time yeah. this week to do what you want to do. We're going to have a fun little science activity for you guys. We're going to bake something together and... Uh, Again, we'll just end up having a great week together. We love you guys. Um, hopefully you're learning a lot and you're not just saying that you're going to do something, but let's go ahead and, and do something this week. Even if you weren't that person who was, was doing stuff before, this could be the week that you go ahead and you repent and you do what God is asking you to do. Yo, yo, yo! So we're going to be making brownies, a simple box brownies. And we're going to see how good we can follow directions and clean up afterwards. And we have adult supervision from far away. Comment down below if you think we can do this challenge, follow directions, and make brownies by ourselves and clean up afterwards. What do you think? Let's get started! You can try okay. it, but by so, yourself. It says heat the oven as directed at the bottom chart. Okay, we're just going to heat it to 350. It says put the brownie mix, water, oil, and eggs. So I'll put in the brownie mix. I'll just start with that. So we preheated the oven. Now we're going to put in the brownie mix, the water, Let's oil, and eggs. If I can open this. <laughs> Guys, filled it. Okay, so we need three tablespoons of water. Jenna can get it. Clean 
up as you go. We're gonna use this my extra mama. little oil to my grease it. Okay, so we're gonna pour it in. And oh. stop, the preheating, it has 100 more degrees to go. What? This is crazy, guys, wait. What? what? Look how much it got out. Wait, what? We should make it's an so like satisfied. greased. What? No, this is really crazy. This thing. is really crazy. And almost every single last thing came out, and usually it sticks to the pan. Now we're gonna clean up the table. I'm gonna wipe up these stuff. This is done. I was gonna add something else, and I was maybe would have added pretzels, but we don't have pretzels. We do have marshmallows, but I don't know if that's gonna work. It might burn. So I'm gonna take it safe way and let's clean up. <laughs> We have an oven lid, like and we have this, and this is how you're supposed to grab it. So I'm going to show you while we're putting it in the oven. Who's going to do it? Me! Okay, we're opening the oven. We have our safety mitts on. Ah. This, if you're baking, you usually should have adult supervision, but we're allowed to do this. There's adults nearby. I really don't know. I checked it two times, and it's still soft inside. It's not cooked. Yeah. I think we failed this challenge. We did clean up good. We brought out the stuff so we can do the decoration, but so sad. I thought we would win. I don't. I don't understand. I'm just gonna let it cool and then decorate. Okay. But we have to wait. I'm. I'm. Hi guys, just a quick note to parents for this week. I learned a lot from this story myself because I know as a parent with multiple children, we have kids, I have kids that say no for the most part to everything and the kids that will say yes for the most part to a lot of things. And I love this story because the kid who says no does surprise you and um, the kid who says yes, who knows, maybe they got distracted, maybe they said yes because they just wanted to please dad and I think that this helps me to really learn that um, I need to deal with my children's characters, that's the most important thing, that my no child may just need some time to reflect, to think, and then to repent. And my yes child might sometimes just be being religious and not wanting to be in trouble and is just doing things to please me and not understanding the heart behind it. So let's this week focus on our kids' hearts and their characters, the reason they're doing what they're doing, and really encourage them to be their best. Oh, welcome to the lab. We're gonna be making the wizard's brew. I like to call it elephant toothpaste. Here we go. Beaker, baby. Step one, we're gonna put the funnel thing over there. So, four OZs of baking powder. I think that's good. No, it's all the way to the top. <laughs> yeah, cook it. That's too good. Ah, uh, you serious? Whatever. You know, no perfect, perfect. Gonna cool. pull that. Yeah, gonna pull that in. Now we got to get the dish soap. The dish dish soap. soap. I like to call it bubble goop. Oh, yeah. Bubblies. Oh. Okay, we're going to put it all the way up to one tablespoon, which is, um, oh, my. What is that? Okay, yeah. I'll go on, on the way to the first, to the first line, to the first line, to the first line, one tablespoon. That's good, that's good, that's good, perfectly. Yeah, that's a little, that's good, that's good. Yeah, that, that's amazing. Yeah, that's good. That's amazing. Right, it's amazing. Okay, so, you got to put that in. Yummy, yummy. So then, what? this baby gonna put some vinegar all the way up to the, yeah, all the way up to the top. Oh, and it stinks. Yes, this is red wine vinegar, so we don't have to put in food coloring. If you want to put food coloring, that's optional. That's your bad. Hey, and it stinks. So, three. This is where all the fun starts. It explodes. You're gonna go. One, two, three. Three! <laughs> Secret ingredients, baby. Yeah, it, it's it gets gonna, a little toxic. It, it, Do not eat. Little children out there, 
Do not eat. It's not for the eats. It's not like my mama's pasta.